finished my lift and I'm about to do some abs and then I'm going to do ab workout. This is what I did for my upper body day and this is what I'm about to do for my ab workout. Also excuse, I look like an egg because my hair slipped in a bun and I was warm. But we're going to get that done. We've got 10 minutes until we have to start getting ready. I just finished my ab workout and now I'm about to get dressed. I have my outfit figured out right here. The outfit of the day, this is just a brown long sleeve from Aerie. Sorry my mirror is really dirty, that's actually really nasty. And these white jeans are from H&M. I don't think they sell them anymore, but I'll try to link it if they do. I don't really know how I'm feeling about this like loose shirt with these pants. Like I feel like it should be some of a tighter vibe. That's fine, maybe I'll like tuck it in or something. It seems like too loose. We'll figure it out. This is the tucked look, I don't know if I'll keep it like this, but... Warm vanilla sugar perfume. Yesterday, I actually forgot to wear earrings to school. It felt really weird because I literally always have earrings in. Like, you'll never catch me without them. And these are from Forever 21. I'm wearing for my boyfriend. I have a jewelry tour posted on TikTok if you want to watch that. It just makes it so much easier waking up early when I already have everything set out the night before. God, I need to take this bun out. Like, I'm not vibing with this. I'm gonna wait until I go to the bathroom, do my hair, even though I literally look like a homeless person, but it's okay. Now it's time to make breakfast. If you watched my what I eat in a week video, you would have seen what I'm making like a more in-depth tutorial of this. But my English English muffins with lunch meat and eggs. But this time instead I'm gonna be topping my eggs with feta cheese, which is one of my favorites because we have some and I just love eggs and feta, so <laughs> this water bottle this tumbler off amazon i got it as a gift so i just like to fill this up with two cups of water and i add some lemon juice and it tastes amazing if you're dusting you don't think so but i do my eggs just finished up in the microwave so i'm gonna assemble the sandwiches the turkey last week i used ham but this time i used turkey and it was like really moist this time like it was very slimy, so hopefully it tastes okay. I mean, I think it should because just lunch meat and normally like that, but like this time it seemed weird. I'm running pretty behind schedule, but when am I not when I'm filming? I'm about to eat my breakfast. It's fine. I'm just gonna eat. I'm like super, super behind schedule. I'm just not filling breakfast in the morning, so it's gonna last me like the five hours until we have lunch at school. It gives me brain power and energy. I'm gonna go brush my teeth. You gotta be kidding me. I'm already so behind and there's no toothpaste. I'm just gonna just get my backpack and everything else that's downstairs. And I don't even know where the toothpaste is. Are you kidding me? No big thing. Not that I well under pressure. Like, I look really busy. But I don't love being stressed and under a time crunch. That's why I don't really like filming morning routines on the weekdays. Like, especially in depth ones like this. Um, uh, my backpack we're down here. Let's go upstairs and get these teeth brushed. Now it's time to do my hair. I'm gonna take out my bun and my ruler. an octo body because this angle is really low but i just finished packing my backpack to do my skincare i just go in with this niacinamide serum i've said this in like every single video that i show my morning routine because like it's literally been the same thing since the beginning of the school year same exact products like even the same bottle and everything it's just because i like to be consistent and that's what works for me this is different though like it's the same exact kind but it's still the same set of fill moisturizer I'm actually really liking these bangs, like, I don't know, I never thought I was going to be a bangs person, but To be honest, I don't think I'm going to sleep in a bun again because, like, I feel like my hair, all I did was make it frizzy If I wasn't in a rush, I probably would have had more time to, like, fix it I'm feeding my fish right now A little bit hot, I'm still behind So I'm going to do my makeup and I'm going to do that in hyperlapse because I've already done a makeup tutorial on, like, 
gone in depth about it so i'm just gonna film that in hyperlapse and you can just watch me do my makeup what i also hate is that i'm doing this all on my phone so like i can't do anything on my phone it's okay i just wish my camera was working but i'll try to fix it by my next video i'm gonna do my makeup and i'll be back <laughs> shirt and i actually like my lip liner went on so smoothly i was so surprised and like oh you can see my lip gloss i love the mascara today like i don't know and this hair is giving wolf cut vibes although that's not what i have it's literally just layers and like bangs but anyway i think i'm gonna go put my shoes on and then i'm gonna try to do my hair because i have seven minutes until i have to be out of the bus the converse are on can you really braid hair pretty fast unless the braids are really thin and that's where we run into a problem but i just wanted to talk about balancing our time because like i said i'm kind of in a rush this morning and even though i did wake up really early I just think my workout is already out of the way so we don't have to worry about that and especially with like vlogging that takes up a lot of my time because i end up talking for a while and when i talk it just puts like random breaks in between like where i would normally be doing things my routine that can slow me down a little bit and as you saw i was actually 10 minutes behind schedule which is why i ended up rushing yes i did get stressed but i just tried to focus on getting everything done and not focus on the stress part and look at me i'm doing my hair it's literally three minutes until i have to be outside i know that it can get really really stressful especially if you're under like a lot of pressure but if you just don't focus on the stress and focus on getting everything done and like what's more important then i feel like you're not gonna get as stressed out and it'll just be a lot easier to deal with a situation like this can apply to anything like managing your time tests it's in school for example like if you're really 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 stressed then you're just gonna focus all your attention on this one question or this one section and you're not gonna get through it because you're gonna be worrying too much but if you just take a deep breath and go through it you're gonna make it and these braids are gonna be really uneven if i don't make this higher so are you seriously joking okay i just lost the band just another thing i'm just gonna go get a new one and finish tying this it's okay hair is done and sweater is on only one minute behind so I'm gonna go outside to make this mess. I'll film a little outro to this video when I get back home from school, but I'm gonna go to school right now and I'll see you guys after. Hey guys, it's nighttime now and I just got back from hanging out with my friends. We went to get hot chicken and I also got some boba. I got a chai milk tea with like just these boba. I don't know, they're just normal boba. All I did was say, can I get a chai milk tea with boba? Really good. Love this so much, like I love chai. And I love boba, so perfect combination. But anyway, that's besides the point. Now that I'm back home, I can actually finish my video because I'm not in a rush. But thank you guys so much for watching. Please like and subscribe. I hope you enjoyed seeing my hectic morning routine. And I hope you enjoyed my talk about trying to push through the struggles and like what to do when you're in a hurry or stressed. So I hope it helped you. I'm still really glad that you're here and... Thank you for watching. Follow my other socials at I'm just Abby and it is just Abby. I love you guys so much and I hope to catch you in the next one. Bye!